East Texas may be a little safer when it comes to wildfires. They now have another way to learn how to keep us safe. KLTV7's Meredith Billings has our story. 24 more firefighters are now certified to fight wild land fires. For the first time, Kilgore College Fire Academy hosted the class. Academy Director Johnny Zachary said the addition was a long time coming and in high demand. Texas and Forest Service holds these courses, but then they are limited on, they can only do so many a year. As far as this area, it's the first it's been done this way without bringing in another entity to teach it. Students learned how to handle grass and forest fires while staying safe themselves. Once certified, they are qualified to handle these fires across the U.S. and even internationally. Zachary said the wildfire training is necessary, especially before summer. Right now we have a tremendous amount of rain. Everything's green. We see a lot of growth of plant life. Come July and August, if the rains don't continue, which they typically don't, then all that foliage that's green becomes what we call fuel load. 24-year-old Lieutenant Jenna McDowell says learning about wildfires can be complicated. What type of grass is this? What type of trees is this? If the wind goes this way, how are we going to put this out? She says it won't take long for the hard work to pay off. Having the correct people out there to have the credentials and know how to take care of it and to save lives and structures and people around us, it's very important to have. If you feel like you want to be a firefighter and you think you're scared to do all the physical stuff and learn about everything else, you can do it. Anyone can do this. You just have to have the heart and the determination to keep going. The Academy plans to offer the 40-hour course again in October with a cap of 24.